Alternating Hemiplegia of Childhood, AHC, is a rare neurological disorder caused by a mutation in the gene ATP1A3. AHC is named for the transient episodes of hemiplegia from which those with the disorder suffer. These hemiplegic episodes can cause anything from mild weakness to complete paralysis on one or both sides of the body, and they can vary greatly in duration. Episodes may also alternate from one side of the body to the other, or alternate between affecting one or both sides during a single episode. AHC is associated with many symptoms besides hemiplegia, and the majority of these become apparent in early infancy. AHC typically presents before the age of 18 months. Normally, hemiplegia and other associated symptoms cease completely with sleep, but they may recur upon waking. AHC is extremely rare. Approximately one in every million people has this disorder. Besides hemiplegia, symptoms of the disorder include an extremely broad range of neurological and developmental impairments, which are not well understood. Particular triggers can bring on hemiplegic attacks and management of AHC often centers on avoiding common or known triggers. While triggers vary greatly from person to person, there are also some common triggers that are prevalent in many patients. Common triggers include temperature changes, water exposure, bright lights, certain foods, emotional stress, strong odor, and physical activity. While avoiding triggers may help, it cannot prevent all hemiplegic episodes because many occur without being triggered. Because attacks and other associated symptoms end with sleep, various sedatives can be used to help patients sleep. The most common drug used to treat AHC is flunarizine, but it is only effective in 50% of the cases. AHC associations worldwide are working towards a cure for AHC. If you think you can support our cause in any way, please go to the AHC International Alliance webpage ahcia.org to find an AHC association for more information.